Hi everyone, I'm Isabel, the kids director from Region 78. A few weeks back, I received a text from an aunt for her nephew. So this kid in Vichy Kids, um, he will usually be very distracted and not the most vocal in class. But the aunt was sharing how he prayed very specifically for healing for his mum who fell down. And that how the family was shocked that, you know, that he prayed like that because they have never heard him pray this way. So I want to thank God that you know, even though sometimes our kid may be distracted or they may be listening, but when as we choose to invest in them, God can really be speaking and be using them even in their lives. Hi everyone, I'm Justin. I'm from Region 910 and I'm a small group leader for 7 to 12. Just about a month ago, we had a new visitor from Hong Kong. His name is Carlin. And just so happened, uh, it is the Holy Communion week and I didn't know if he was safe. So I approached him, I shared Jesus with him, and he was open. Uh, I subsequently uh, said a sinner's prayer together with him, and uh, I thank God for the opportunity uh, for me to be there on that day uh, to lead him to Jesus. Hello, I'm Jihan. I'm 10 turning 11 this year. I want to thank God for moving in my family. I was told that people who don't believe in Jesus would not go to heaven, so I would not see them there. I felt sad that my daddy was not a believer and that I would not see him in heaven. One day, my daddy asked me to pray with him for his work and life. After praying, I asked him if he wanted to receive Jesus into his heart. At first, he hesitated, but after that he said okay. I googled the sinner's prayer online and he said it. I want to thank God for bringing my daddy to believe in him. I give God all the glory.